So tonight on Pure Country Reacts, I don't know if you guys uh, remember our Hood Meals videos. Um, some decent ideas made with some really questionable stuff in really questionable ways. Well, we found another TikToker. His name is Haritsu. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Haritsu. Haritsu. Okay, there you go. There's my child. And um, he... um. He makes food, and I, you can look at this guy, I'm telling you, okay, he has some skills. He really does. He has skills. You can tell he does. Now, if he's doing this in order to get views, it's a possibility. Um, if he's doing this to make people nauseous and sick, he's probably doing that too. Um, I don't know why he's doing it. However, when you see some of this stuff... And it's mostly, from what I can tell, more of the Asian cuisine. I'm not sure Haritsu is possibly where, maybe Japan? Japanese. Maybe Japan or something he, like yeah, that. Yeah, he's Japanese. Because you'll see some of the wording at the bottom, not exactly sure, but... Um, and we're just going to give you a few of these, okay? We, you, we're going to have to, to, to let you in sort of slowly, okay? Because this is really going to... This is really going to disturb you. I mean, it really is. And we're not talking about anything other than the the utter um, filth that grime. I, the grime that, that that he possibly lives in. Now, I think a lot of times, like with hood meals, the guy that does it um, come up with a shtick. He come up with something that was successful. Okay, um, and I think this guy is doing the same thing because I can't imagine anybody living in certain conditions unless they absolutely just really didn't have any money or something like that. And I know some people can, but if you've got technology, um, then sometimes I have a tendency to maybe doubt it a little bit. But when you watch this guy prepare some of this food, seriously, he does have skills. And it really made me wonder when I found some of his videos before. I thought, I said, he's got to be some type of a chef or a cook or something where he lives because he did actually make some some excellent cuts i may have to close my eyes for some of this i've not seen all his videos i've seen some of his videos and they are quite disturbing in the fact that you'll see here let me just show you what i'm talking about before i get started though thank you to our subscribers we appreciate your time we hope that you've had a good week or you've had a good weekend uh, depending upon when you're watching this video we hope that it's been good for you we hope that um, you're enjoying what you see um, if you're new to the channel look around we do a lot of different things we've got to get back to some of our movies and stuff my, my movies that we try to edit and do just typically take a lot longer to get up because there's more issues with trying to get those cut just right where um, you don't get copyright issues and stuff like that and we really don't want to do that also um drop us a comment let us know you know if you like what we did if you like what we do if you'd like to see something else we do get um people who give us some ideas sometimes we always look into those and we give them a test we did give something a test and um could not i could not get it cut right enough to get it to release um i did let the person who had suggested us do a reaction to it i let them know i can't even get it freed up because it was something so short um there was really gonna be nothing left of it so we do look into those and we will try to react to those remember that we do stickly stickly we usually try to stick to horror games movies uh things like that we do reactions and those aren't going to be hard those are typically going to be something funny so we just want people to be able to come to our channel and maybe have an escape for you know just a little bit of time just to kick back and not think about the problems of the world or the problems that you had just kick back and laugh um and um and we hope you keep coming back we really appreciate it so go, let's go ahead and we're going to check out haritsu and um have have something ready because you may have to cover your eyes because it's really going to be it's 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 it's, it's a scary thing y'all so enjoy and oh okay. yeah
All right, so I already reckon us. So that's pork and garlic, and I don't know what is that? Some kind of spice, Lexi. Was that rosemary or thyme? Yeah, and I think it was like thyme. Some thyme. All right. And him touching everything with his bare hands. Okay, y'all. I my my microwave has been dirty at times. Okay. This I, I I'm not sure, and and maybe he's just too busy to clean it. And I can totally understand if you get too busy to clean it. Okay. Just and sometimes it's not even about the food. Sometimes it is just about the atmosphere. The just just look. I mean, I'm seriously counters, and it's really almost like an Asian ver version of hood meals. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can go to TikTok and check out hood meals, or you can go back into some of our older videos. And you know what I'm talking about. It's it's almost about shock factor for how grimy something can be. Look how dirty the, the hmm. pot is, Lexi. Oh my gosh. I mean, seriously, y'all. The cutting boards. I... Look at the wall behind it. <sighs> oh. Hmm. Oh my God. You... <laughs> <sighs> okay, y'all. I don't even. Okay, I don't know. You want me to tell you? What? That. <sighs> that that poor thing is overcooked and it's been boiling. Ew. And really, it does remind me a lot of hood meals. How does somebody eat this and not die? <laughs> And he just pulls plants from his backyard. He really does. I've garnish. seen him do it. I've really seen it. We've seen him do it. I'm sorry. That's just disturbing. Even though if, if, if those things were actually fresh, that would look like a really good meal. And that's why, hold on a minute. Let me see if we're gonna go back and see where we came from. Just gonna give it a test. Oh, he got him a. Did you get him a new cutting board? I guess so, but. The, oh! You know the reason why you need a new cutting board is you need to actually clean it. This is what I mean when I say he has skills, okay? You cannot do this if you. If you don't have some skills, okay. He cooks on those clams. I Remember, Lexi says he goes and he pulls weeds right out of his yard. There you go. Yeah, he puts them in the dish either as a side dish or as a garnish. Or as a garnish. Shall continue. Yep, as part of the dish. And do you know how gross backyard weeds sm taste and smell? Oh, God. I think it is kind of an, a, a, a custom for Asians to know how to at least chop things up. I don't know, y'all, but he keeps his. He get. And I'm not, and I'm not, I'm not throwing shade at this guy. Seriously, I am not. He is obviously very good with his cutting techniques. Okay, not throwing any shade. And hey, with the way our country's going right now, the West is now the the main enemy, and uh, everybody hates us. So we may be eating grass this way one day. So I'm not gonna knock him. I'm probably gonna pay really close attention, actually. Well, I I, <laughs> I think we're just gonna have to go to South Korea. Uh, no. And then we can drop our dad off in Japan. <sighs> and you know, I don't even I don't eat shellfish anyway. Yeah, no, I, I can't do most shellfish just because of how fishy they are. The only one I really love is shrimp. She loves shrimp. She she is definitely a shrimp lover. The crab and lobsters and the Okay, so you got a new one, buddy. Throw it away. Oh, no. Is he going to put that in the dish? 
Please tell me that. Please tell me you're gonna like light the firewood or you're gonna you're not gonna And he's using the wrong knife for everything. Like I said, it just gets worse and worse. Oh, he's a kitty poo. He likes cats. Let's hope he doesn't eat Was he wanting some? <gasps> ah, we will. If anybody can translate this for for us, drop it in the comments. I don't understand that. Don't. Okay, I don't want to witness you eating the wood from your old cutting board. Hey, don't do that. Okay, I think the wood was for seasoning. Well, I would understand that, but that, I don't know about... I don't know. It, yeah. See the message down there? Participating in this activity could result in your you or others getting hurt. Is them noodles? That's rice? That's rice. It's instant rice. Okay, it's frozen. I got no issue with frozen rice. There's onions, garlic, Mushroom. mushrooms, some tofu. kind of tofu. Okay, good. He didn't even like break up the Bless rice. you. one thing Japanese really ain't hurting because the thing is they have so many ingredients for one dish but y'all see the man has skills okay he has skills yeah and since we don't know okay that one wasn't as bad no it wasn't as bad dude that's why you break the rice up dude that's hot that's smoking we come. We have seen him actually fry things and stick his fingers like in the fry pan. The fry pan with the frying grease. And he doesn't. He doesn't flinch or nothing. No. Okay. I've come to the conclusion the man has like no feeling in his fingertips or something. He probably doesn't. All right. We'll go a couple more. Ramen. Spice. Look how spice. Okay. Use some chicken. He's trying to mash up whatever seasoning that was. Okay, that's either cilantro or what's the other one? Parsley. Parsley. And maybe cilantro. Yeah, Asians do like some cilantro. Cilantro is good unless you have the. <laughs> unless you have the gene where you can't eat yeah. cilantro. Some people it... that um, don't like cilantro say it tastes like. So so and it's because they have a gene where they where it tastes like that versus the rest of us. <laughs> See, either it tastes like cilantro or it tastes like soap. Ew. Because the ramen on his chicken. I don't even sound <gasps> It's not cooked! It's not cooked enough, bro. Why didn't they put that message at the bottom of this video? Because the other one wasn't bad at all. Wait a minute. It? He's oh my gosh! He wants salmonella. Yeah, he he obviously likes his chicken rare. I thought. And his eggs rare. And I'm glad he didn't pull weeds out of his yard. Yeah, I can go with the cilantro all day long and twice on Sunday. Okay. Good God, has a whole mouthful. That of is a big bunch of cilantro, but you know cilantro is the bomb. Bless him. And he always, mm. he always does it with the little kitty. But just don't eat the chicken, okay, bro? It was not even remotely close to being done. I love the cat feel. Okay. 
うわこっちがやばいなピカピカにしましょううわくっそ何これ Have you not washed anything? He's washing it, Lexi. Oh my gosh, thank goodness. About time, buddy Ray. Can you imagine the smell? Yeah, Lexi. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe he's moving and he's going clean. Ooh. And now that's the same place. What about your floor, dude? <laughs> You kind of flooded it. Yeah. Okay, looks like he's got some yeah. wings. We, we definitely needed to check him out. That, that, that close to our face. You gotta say he reaches right in there. I've seen him do it in drinks, okay? Fingertips. Okay, so nothing's questionable with this one. Uh, like, like green onion, squash, and chicken leaves. Wings. Chicken wings. What? <sighs> Yellow. Okay, so this one was doable. <laughs> this one was doable. Bless him. Thank you. Thank you. And he cleaned up his kitchen, too. I've never seen him clean up his kitchen, so. Okay. One of the spiciest noodles in Japan. He really doesn't mind wetting his floor. No. See, that's what's interesting, too, is think about it. A lot of the spicier things are actually not red. Because typically people in factories dye it red. So it looks hot. But the thing is, is it, it don't have to look hot to be hot. Interesting point. Interesting point. See, because they don't even look hot at all. Mm -mm. You'd be convinced that they were just regular ramen. Oh, is this like an eating challenge? Like the, the I, one chip challenge? I guess, yeah. Maybe he's not going to drink anything. He looks like his nose is wanting to run a little bit. His eyes oh. oh! Bless him. Mood. It's so All cool. right. All right. Whoa. Oh. You gonna mix and match, I guess. I guess so. Two different hot ones. Three different hot ones. Oh. This poor man. <laughs> Ooh. God. <laughs> that is a lot of noodles. That's paradise for me. I love carbs. <laughs> it's just part of my problem. Dude, I think, uh, honey, I think you need to chill. Oh, God, maybe he's doing like one of those really, really, I'm going to put everything in my mouth as quite as quick as I can, mukbangs or something. First in peace, this man's blood hole when he's done. Yes, yeah, spicy comes out just as spicy as it goes in. I'm a testament to that. Oh, honey. And, and really, you have to wonder. These people's guts have to be, like, dying. Maybe they are more... Maybe their stuff is, like, tougher than ours or something. Well, I mean, if you are around something for a good while, your body can become resistant and... I would think. And accustomed to it. The thing is, when us white people, Americans, tend to eat things when they're in their teens, then it's like, well, it burns a hole through your stomach. Well, yeah. it's because they haven't been eating it their whole life, while I, being a Hispanic, has eaten spices all my life. Yeah. I tend to handle it a little bit better. I, I usually salsa doesn't come out that way. No. Well, it's not. Haritsu. Obviously, it's, obviously it's not. Haritsu. Um, har Haritsu. Haritsu. There we go. We do roll it, but not as as much as I did. Anyway, so we're just giving you a little bit of Haritsu. Um, he's got. Uh, I wouldn't say it's, it's and it's it's an extensive TikTok, but he does have a lot of videos out there, and the ones <laughs> like this are very interesting to watch. But anyway, um, the man definitely has skills. He may act like he don't, and then it could be like Lacey says. Maybe he was raised, you know. Um, cooking a certain way watching his mother cook or whatever i'm not exactly sure but anyway um we're gonna let you 
Um, tell us what you think about Haritsu and um, if you'd like to see more stuff like that. And um, if you haven't done it already, please subscribe. Share our videos with your friends and family. Don't forget the thumbs up at the end. And until our next video, peace. <laughs>